Recitation repels spirits and curses disease. A boy nineteen lay weakly in the hospital bed. His name was Shaolian U. His eyes were lifeless. The doctor's words echoed in his ear. I'm afraid your illness cannot be cured. He felt really depressed. One night, an oppressive dark shape appeared in the brightly lit ward and dashed towards the boy. Dear me, the guardians of the underworld are here. They are so scary. He jumped up in terror. Namo Amitabha Buddha. Namo Amitabha Buddha. Namo Amitabha Buddha. Immediately, the demons were startled by his recitation voice. They tread around him anxiously, daring not to come close. Later, even King Yama showed up in a flourish. He tried to catch the boy, but could not approach. As the recitation of Amitabha's name blocked his steps, you are making too much noise. Stop reciting. Can't you hear me? Said a doctor impatiently. So Shao, whose recitations become louder and louder, was moved to another ward. He used all his strength to call out, "Namo Amitabha Buddha!" Nearly five days later, a golden light fell from the sky like a meteor. It shone brightly upon the hospital, clearing away the spooky atmosphere. The boy saw Amitabha Buddha standing in the golden radiance. Smiling at him compassionately, he felt safe, like a newborn baby being embraced by its mother. The next day, Shaw recovered and was discharged from the hospital. He was excited and joyful, with his lips still moving ceaselessly. He thought, reciting Amitabha's name is so good. So good. Namo Amitabha Buddha. Namo Amitabha Buddha. Thank you. Namo Amitabha Buddha.